Hello, welcome to another video on uh, number theory. In this video, uh, we are uh, going to discuss some applications of Jacobi uh, symbols and uh, legend symbols. Uh, along with that, uh, we will uh, discuss uh, applications of quadratic reciprocity laws, reciprocity laws for both uh, Jacobi and uh, uh, legend symbols. Consider the example one. It's a question. Uh, here it is asked to find uh, the uh, first one is the number, the symbol number. Uh, that is the legend symbol number. It is asked to find the legend symbol number. Uh, but uh, you can say whether it is a legend symbol or Jacobi symbol only by knowing that uh, whether the second number is uh, uh, is an odd prime or not. If the second number is uh, not an uh, no, not an order prime, then uh, the uh, number asked to find is uh, um, is the Jacobi symbol, not the Lagrange symbol. So that's an important thing. Whether uh, you are verifying whether uh, the given the second number uh, in the symbol notation is uh, an order prime or uh, not. So here uh, you, you have to find the uh, sim the uh, legendary symbol number 888 bar 1 uh, 1999. Uh, you know it can be verified that 1999 is a prime number uh, using uh, you know no you know using you know uh, we can apply uh, the complete multiplicative property. So since 999 is a uh, is a prime number, so this uh, will become. Uh, the, the, the symbol number uh, is the legendary symbol number. Here it is asked to find the legendary symbol number. Now you can apply uh, the um, uh, the multiplicative, complete multiplicative property of legendary symbol because you know that uh, legendary symbol possess that property. But uh, in addition to that, uh, due to the information that 888 uh, is, is a composite number, 888 can be uh, factorized. Uh, how can we factorize that? That can be factorized, factorized as uh, 2 into 2 into 2 uh, into 111. But 111 can again be factorized as uh, 3 into 37. Okay, 111. Therefore, total five, all, uh, the complete factorization is 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 into 37 is the factorization of the number uh, 888. Then bar uh, 1999. Now, by using the complete multiplicative property of uh, the legendary symbol, you can write it as the product of uh, uh, the legendary symbols. Four legendary, uh, sorry, five legendary symbols, and that is uh, two bar uh, 1999 into two bar 1999 into two bar 1999 three times into uh, three bar 1999 into 37 bar 1999. But that can be combined. The first three can be combined, uh, and you can write that uh, it's equal. To, uh, um, you can write finally that expression two bar uh, 1999, the whole cube into three bar 1999 into 37 bar 1999, and two bar th uh, 1999 can be uh, can be used uh, can can be given uh, using uh, the theorem using the theorem 9.5. You have the theorem in the theorem 9.5. You know that uh, you know. Uh, the value for uh, uh, two bar uh, p, two bar p, where uh, where p is an old prime, sorry n bar p, you, uh, sorry sorry, uh, yeah, it's the that gives the value for two bar p, that uh, uh, two is the specific uh, number, two is a specific number, and in that case, uh, you have the value. Using that, uh, uh, using that uh, uh, result, you can find the value in this case. And for that, you know, uh, specifically in order to uh, uh, know the exact accurate value for uh, 2 bar 1999, you have to divide uh, p by p here in this pro in this case, in this situ situation, p is equal to 1999, it's a prime number. And that can be, that should be divided by 8 and you should find the remainder. When it is divided by 8, uh, and you can see that uh, the remainder is 7. So, since uh, na that is 1999 equal to 249, 249 into 8. 1999 equal to 249 into 8 plus 7. The 7 is the remainder. Since 7 is the remainder, you can uh, see that minus 1 is the. Uh, yeah. When 1999 is uh, divided by 8, you get. Uh, uh, you can uh, say that. Uh, yeah. 
uh, 7 is the remainder but you can write that uh, 1999 is congruent to minus 1 mod 8 see this is the uh, congruence expression obtained by uh, 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 using this uh, using this expression using this uh, division and uh, uh, finding the after obtaining the remainder you can write that it is uh, you can write that 1999 is congruent to minus 1 mod 8 and therefore uh, using this fact you know so you know uh, that uh, um, referring that uh, uh, result referring the result you get an idea about that answer uh, therefore 2 bar 1999 equal to plus 1 so this is the first case of that uh, uh, you know th there exists two values plus 1 and minus 1 so and this is the case uh, uh, this congruence says that uh, uh, it belongs to the first case okay Uh, next, uh, uh, you can um, you can find. Now, next we can uh, proceed to find uh, the value three bar nineteen ninety nine. Three bar nineteen ninety nine, and we can uh, use the quadratic reciprocity law you know, to obtain uh, this number. The value for this number, you can apply the quadratic reciprocity law. And that quadratic reciprocity law, when it is applied to this particular uh, pair of numbers, you get that uh, 3 bar 1999 uh, into 1999 bar 3 equal to uh, minus 1. Uh, this is, you know, uh, this is the quadratic reciprocity law for, uh, um, yeah, the reciprocity law for uh, the legendary symbol. So, it uh, answer is equal to minus 1 raised to 3 minus 1 this number, this prime number minus 1 by 2 uh, into uh, the second prime number 1999 minus 1 divided by 2 and that is uh, um, that's equal to minus 1 raised to 1 into here we get 1 and, and that in the second bracket we get 1999 thus we get that answer equal to minus 1. So, our final answer is minus 1 for this number and also uh, we know that uh, uh, we can now apply that uh, uh, again congruence can be uh, used congruence method can be used to find the uh, find further the value of 1999 uh, bar 3 so now we are going to find the value specifically uh, this 1999 bar 3 uh, that legendary symbol value can be determined uh, directly so to in order to determine that uh, we, uh, we we can again verify that you need to verify that uh, uh, verify what is going to get uh, when you divide 1999 div uh, by 3 what is the remainder so you can see that one you will get uh, one as the remainder when and the number 1999 is divided by 3 since one is the remainder therefore you can write that 1999 is congruent to 1 mod 3 and thus uh, you know, uh, using that, uh, using the fact that uh, 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 in the case of a legend, legendary symbol uh, where p is an order prime, uh, you know that uh, m bar p equal to n bar p if and only if uh, m is congruent to n mod uh, p. We know that uh, using that result, and this this is uh, this result uh, is uh, um, it is related to uh, the periodicity of uh, the legendary symbol. You know, so you can simply see, you can say that applying the periodicity of the legendary symbol uh, in order to check uh, um, which, which number uh, this is congruent, uh, 1999 is congruent that you know need to do. So since we have verified that 1999 the number the the, the uh, when, when uh, this can be applied to obtain the legendary symbol value 1999 bar 3 so when you uh, since this number is very big uh, bigger uh, it's, it's a big uh, bigger than uh, the, the second the uh, second number so since it's a big number then you can apply you have to apply that uh, periodicity um, or uh, uh, yeah periodicity property can be applied uh, or you can use that the congruence relation or the, the effect of congruence on uh, the value of the legendary symbol in both way you can say that say uh, the same thing uh, okay then applying uh, the periodicity uh, you know since we since we uh, know that 1999 is congruent to 1 mod mod 3 so this is a verified in this, in this step you can uh, start afresh and uh, a new step is uh, started here and uh, you can verify whether it is correct 
um, okay and this is not uh, actually it is not verification you are finding the number uh, to which uh, the uh, number 1999 is congruent um, with respect to the mod 3 mod 3 okay and therefore you can write that using that periodicity 1999 bar 3 is uh, equal to my 1 bar 3 uh, but 1 bar 3 uh, can be determined equal to 1 see 1 bar 3 equal to 1 bar 3 equal to 1 you know that that result yeah and uh, one bar one bar p equal to one for all values of uh, uh, p for whatever uh, is the value of p and then one bar p equal to one so using that result you can write easily one bar three equal to one next uh, you can substitute uh, in the next step we will substitute these values so 1999 here you know uh, this value has been determined this is this value is determined and this is now simplified and so uh, substituting the value uh, since uh, this value since the value equal to 1 1 can be substituted here and this is the simplified value minus 1 and therefore you get that 3 bar 1999 uh, equal to uh, minus uh, 1 okay Therefore, 3 bar 99 equal to 1 in uh, that number into 1 equal to minus 1. Therefore, uh, it's equal to minus 1. Similarly, this, the, the similar procedure can be applied to uh, find uh, the number, uh, legendary symbol value 13, 37 bar 1999. See, 1999 is the number here. Uh, that uh, last two digits are, are uh, not visible. So, you must correct that. And the full number is 1999. Uh, therefore, 37 bar 1999 uh, for, uh, can be determined using the steps of uh, uh, reciprocity law, uh, legend of a uh, legend of symbol. So, uh, 37 bar 1999 into 1999 bar 37 equal to minus 1 to the power of uh, 37. This number 37 minus 1 divided by 2 into uh, this number is uh, that uh, is not uh, seen there fully. So, the number is uh, 1999. This number 1999 minus 1. Then 1 is subtracted. Minus 1 divided by 2. And that equal to minus 1 raised to 18. Minus 1 raised to 18 into uh, 1999 okay that's equal to plus one because uh, uh, the power uh, is an even number we have an even even number is a power uh, uh, in the power we have an even number for minus one therefore we get one and then um, also we, we again we can once again we are going to apply that uh, the periodicity of uh, the legendary symbol uh, for that uh, you find the uh, you you divide you need to divide the number 1999 by 37 and you need to find the remainder so uh, that is done here 1999 can be written equal to 54 into 37 uh, plus 1 so 1 is the remainder and therefore we can write 1999 is congruent to 1 or mod 37 so uh, 19 uh, you, you can here conclude this step can be concluded that 1999 bar 37 equal to 1 by um, yeah, one bar, not uh, 1999 bar 37. The legend of symbol 1999 bar 37 equal to one bar 37. But one bar 37 again using in the previous uh, as in the previous discussion, you can uh, write that equal to one and uh, one bar 37 equal to one. Then substituting this value in the above expression, where in this expression you can substitute here, you can substitute 1 and you can simplify this quantity and finally get that uh, uh, this quantity simplified quantity is 1 and therefore 37, 37 bar 1999, therefore 37 bar 1999 into 1 equal to uh, 1, hence you get that 37 bar 1999 equal to 1. Thus, we have obtained all the uh, values, all the three values. Therefore, 888 bar 1999 equal to 2 bar 1999, the whole cube into 3 bar 1999 uh, into 37 bar 1999. That's, these values are substituted. The actual values are substituted and then simplified to obtain. Finally, you get minus 1. That's the answer. Okay, we get, uh, we, you know, an, an, a result is, uh, a related result is important uh, here, uh, you know, for in the case of a legendary symbol, uh, you, you may note this uh, result, uh, P bar, where P and Q are two order primes, suppose, P and Q are two order primes, then P bar Q equal to 1 divided by uh, P bar Q. You, you know, you can see that P bar Q equal to 1 divided by P, uh, P bar Q. Why this uh, result? Because uh, you know that uh, p bar q equal to either plus 1 or minus 1. p bar q is either plus 1 or minus 1. Uh, then 
when we take its square uh, p bar q the whole square that equal to p bar q into p bar q right p bar q into p bar q p bar q the whole square equal to that equal to plus or minus either plus one or minus one but you have to take the square equal to plus one therefore p bar q into p bar q the square can be p bar q left side left side can be split into two uh, product of uh, two legend of symbols p bar q into p bar q equal to one therefore p bar q equal to one by p bar q you know uh, while solving some problems on this kind of uh, simplifying uh, expressions are required the result as uh, simplifying results are important and uh, they may come uh, in into use uh they that will uh, that can help us in some while uh, solving some problems okay okay thank you for listening